Scotland's First Minister Nicola Sturgeon is to warn that if Britain were to leave the EU, it could create an unstoppable clamour for another independence referendum. In a speech in Brussels, the SNP leader will say that Scotland must remain in Europe and call for David Cameron to make a positive case for EU membership. Creating cheap, clean energy is the greatest scientific challenge facing mankind. That's according to a group of eminent scientists and economists this morning. They're calling for the environmental equivalent of the Apollo space program to make renewable energy cheaper than coal in every country within 10 years. The idea has been supported by Sir David Attenborough. This at last is something which says if we do this, which is practical and comprehensible, we can solve a lot of our problems. And I find that very inspiring and very exciting. Experts believe they have discovered Britain's oldest sauropod. Have I said it right? Hope so. Dinosaur. After a fossil of a vertebrae the size of a football fell out of a cliff in Whitby. He's been named Alan after the man who found it. Scientists say the find adds to existing evidence that large herbivores once roamed across Yorkshire. And with a bit of luck, next time round, we'll show you a picture of it. I think we might be able to. Yeah. Uh, coming up on the programme, uh, Matt will have the weather for you in about ten minutes' time. Sally's so here with the sport. Talking of dinosaurs, is that a bit cheeky? Ooh. I'm talking about FIFA this morning. Mm. More fallout from all the trouble last week. The scandal continues from the ongoing corruption scandals that have engulfed FIFA. Three of their officials were suspended last night by FIFA's own ethics committee following investigations by American prosecutors. The officials include Enrique Sanz, General Secretary of CONCACAF, the governing body of football in North and Central America. Two other African officials were also suspended by FIFA. And in addition, the former head of South America's soccer federation, Nicolas Leos, has been put under house arrest.